opportunity for this man, but he has put in all the right work, and a lot of people give him a great chance to get the job done tonight. You know, when you've been there and you get back here, it's not new. There are a lot of things that are familiar, but how do you change the result? How do you assure that in this time, during this chance, you ultimately walk away with the championship? He's been here before, John. The team's been here before. They are confident that this time, they get it done. And that self-belief is rooted in the preparation, right? He's got speed, he's got power, all the tools to rest the belt away. We'll see if we have a new West Hollywood champion. martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, John. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Bruce Lee in a Just so wise. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. To get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. It's time! Five round for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger. Assassin! And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Herb Dean, our referee Please for fight. this one. Ready. All right, here's Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles, and it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Flush knee to the body. He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. Fighter lands a nasty kick. Beautiful left hand punch. So more output, at least in the early going. Came of inches right there, Damn. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Let's go. Back and forth we go. All right, 
side, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quickly. I mean, just right away, it's last in the jab after jab after jab. He's a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind an educated jab. Oh, it lands a nice straight. Well, it lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Just over three minutes to go. Slips to avoid the right. Nice body kick. Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Look at how he turned his hip into that leg kick. Cannot take too many hills. Oh, big left hook there. Oh, nice body shot. Ooh, looking to set up that head kick. Punches in bunches? Punches in bunches. He's landing them upside his opponent's head over and over again. Under two minutes to go. Three punch. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to, starting to add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack, not being one-dimensional, not head-hunting inside the octagon. I, I think he has fought beautifully right now. He's starting to show himself. Oh, picture-perfect shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Big left hook coming. It's good. Hands on this play. Another punch lands. Under a minute now to go in the round. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on the Oh, he's in a world of trouble now. Oh, nice right hand. That's a perfect shot. Oh, goes for the ankle pick now to get him down, DC. We'll see how he chooses to proceed from here. Got the ankle pick. Let's see how he advances from this position. Sidekick now. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Nice block. Hard shots landing on both sides here. He's back in the clinch. Let's see what he does now. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights, DC. A lot of leg kicks for good measure in that round. I mean, leg kicks are the key. You watch people win fights with just leg kicks, especially in this game. I mean, it is my strike of choice. I love the animation when I've landed so many leg kicks that my opponent just kind of waves me off and the fight gets stopped. Keep throwing them. If they're not going to check them, keep throwing the leg kick. You ready to fight? You ready? Good. Second round underway. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Oh, wow. How about the roundhouse kick? Oh, he's wobbled now. Wow, what a head kick. Oh, really using his reach advantage. 
advantage there with that land, DC. Man, both fighters realizing a lot of success early. Back and forth we go. Lee's got a bruise appearing on that left side right now. You gotta think that body investment is gonna pay dividends later. Right on the button. Oh! I'm not sure how he stayed up right. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, to stay standing shows and talks to your toughness. All right, well, good news is he rocked him. Bad news is he wasn't able to finish the job, and now his opponent's back in the fight. I mean, you don't get those opportunities very often. You got to take full advantage of them when they're presented to you. All right, so that opened up a cut around his eye area. He hasn't moved his head well. He's taking shots too clean, and now a cut has opened up. Well, he's landed a few big uppercuts already. I was... in the single collar tie. And he lands another knee there. DC, it doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. Oh, the accuracy land right there. His opponent's wobbled to He's hurt bad. He cannot take another shot like that. Under three minutes now to go in the round. This pace is just absurd, and he has kept it up throughout the fight. Shades of Max Holloway against Calvin Cater. Punches in both. Oh, trying to recover, but he's in a lot of trouble. Oh, huge left. It's okay. Nice body Keep shot. Going. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Defense there, huge block for him. Well, I think I can smell the blood at this point in time. That canvas didn't look like that a few fights ago. Blood is flowing from that cut with every passing strike. Every strike. And it burns. John, it burns so bad. When you get cut like that, every time a shot lands, it just burns. So this guy needs to try to find a way to not take and limit the damage he's taken to this cut. Easier said than done, though. Under two minutes now to go. Don't play. Don't play. That is a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to eat too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh! Big right hand. Come on, man. Let's get that takeout. All right, gets inside, gets the single collar tie here. Oh, now gets an underhook to get a more dominant position. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instance. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here. And as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Lee's eye now closing up. Five seconds remain in the round. Oh, nice jab up top by Lee. Oh. Under 30 seconds. Twenty seconds to go, round two. Nice punch, Lynn. What a fun fight. These two are going back and forth. Those are the body kicks that are probably. Now he's got the single collar and the clinch. Huh. Good round. Huh. All right, so the round is over, and you see the cut man not wasting any time as the fighter makes his way back to the stool. The cut man will try to shut that cut on the bridge of his nose and prevent it from becoming a factor here moving forward. All right, let's get you a replay from that previous round. It was the big knockdown courtesy of that kick that, that nearly closed the show for good. It almost closed the show, but nothing's more discouraging than when you get somebody hurt that bad and you don't shut the door. He has to go back to work now knowing 
that he's got about as tough a guy as, if, as he's ever had in front of him in the octagon tonight. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, here we go with this third round of this championship fight. All right, so next round underway here, and you got to admire the stamina that both of these guys still exuded towards the end of that round. Both men put a particular focus on their cardiovascular commitment in this training camp, and it's clearly paid dividends here tonight. We have two legitimately fresh fighters here as we hit this next round. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He huge shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Oh, with authority, the body. Oh, oh, massive right hand. Well, missed on that one. He's got a good leg kick. There it is. Man, how good is this? Back and forth we go. Body kick lands. His opponent still stands. I mean, I have no idea. This fight is over. It might not be over now, but it's got to be over very soon. Back to the feet now. Beautiful spinning kick lands. Oh, my goodness. Big right hand there. Oh, nice kick. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Well, at this point, DC, I'm not sure if he's just biding his time or just trying to get some extra reps, but go finish the guy. It seems like the guy's playing with his food. You know, he's having a good time out there. Everything's working. He's in the... Oh! He's hurt so bad. He's got to find safety. Find a way that you can recover. Please look shot blocked, though, by the defense. Nice job getting that guard up to prevent any further damage. Well, you know this is the hurt business, and both guys are compromised at this stage of the fight. Yeah, both guys are compromised. Both guys have been beat up. Both guys have done a great job of landing, recognizing what they wanted to get done, and it's showing. This is a very evenly matched fight. About two minutes here to go in round three. Well, when you're dealing with a cut like that, it may not be long before it starts to impact the breathing. Not a good spot to be in here. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Oh, nasty cut there, right on the bridge of the nose. Checks that leg kick. Somehow, his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Let's work, guys. Oh, no! Power shots landing on both sides, and the chins continue to hold up. All right, less than a minute here to go now in round three. Oh! Inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night at that man. Oh! Yeah, he's hurt really bad. Lee's cut on his nose does not look good. Actually, all right, so the referee, yes, is going to step in here. He will call on the doctor to look at that nose that is unrecognizable at this stage of the fight. His nose is broken. I mean, it's turned sideways. The blood's pouring, going down into his mouth. 
It looks like he's having a very difficult time breathing. Looks like he's almost willing himself to stay in this fight, and Doctor's gonna give him a chance. Somewhat surprising there. That cut is nasty. It's a nasty Ready cut. Fight. Ready. All right, well, this fighter was bullish in his desire to continue, and the doctor is going to avoid it. Oh, 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 well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body, and he hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game plan. championship rounds. All right, so that's the end of the round. That cut on the nose, manageable earlier, not so much right now. Really, really bad. The blood flow continuing to become a factor, and you gotta think at some point, if it gets any worse, they will have no choice but to stop this fight. All right, the truck has produced some replays from that previous round. Perhaps we can even isolate the strike that opened up that cut on the bridge of his nose. It's nasty, and it's in a bad spot because the reality is when you can't breathe through your nose, you start to open your mouth, but the blood is dripping down Ready into your mouth. How is Ready. he going to breathe in order to have a chance to win this fight? All right, here's round four, fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. All right, so here we go. Fourth round is underway. What is the fighter's mentality when you enter the seminal championship rounds? You understand that you are getting close now. The night is almost over. The goal is within reach. Huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Exchange in the pocket here. Looking to land the leg kick now. Back and forth we go. It takes two to tango, and man, have these two individuals tango. Oh, he's in trouble. lit up by that straight punch. Well, if body language is any indication, mentally he is not back in this fight after that knockdown earlier in the round. I mean, we thought the fight was over, so I guess it's a credit to him still even... Oh, you hurt him again, bro. And back to his feet. Oh, there's the head kick. It's blocked. Just over three minutes now to go. Ground strike landed by him there. How much more can one man take? In the half guard. Making all these shots count. Oh, right into ball. Oh, nice right hand by the champ. Yeah. Back to the feet now. shots. Let's see who's going to be the last man standing. Beautiful strike there. Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that finish. Just over two minutes now to go. Very fast jab lands. Well, don't get mad, get even, right? He got stunned by his opponent earlier in the round. He's clearly been losing since. Mentally, it appears as though he's checked out a little bit. A lot easier said than done. When his opponent has the power that he possesses, it's hard for him to say, you know what, I'm going to take one to give one. It's work, guys. Come on. Oh, nice job defensively there to get the guard up. Shot is blocked by Lee. Well, we wondered earlier why there 
weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bear's watching. That's gonna hurt this opponent. Oh, the damage just continues to be inflicted. And with respect to the athletes, if this was a movie, I might just walk out. I don't even see it anymore. I mean, I just don't even see it. it, it it's to a point now where it's getting a bit uncomfortable. You have a... Oh! That's it! That'll do it! Oh, my goodness! I mean, you gotta be kidding me with that knockout. If that is not the number one play on SportsCenter tonight, I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time. I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something and he delivered with that beautiful knockout. The official decision is in. That's where we find Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at three minutes, 54 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout and new undisputed USC heavyweight champion of the world, Assassin. So how about this? We have a new UFC heavyweight champion of the world. I think that guy beats Daniel Cormier. I, think I mean, he does. this guy beats anybody. I'm telling you right now, he is the king of the world for a reason. The number one heavyweight in the world. A guy that possesses knockout power, confidence, and heart. It's going to be very difficult to take this belt away from this champ.